What's up guys, it's the old Ninja Wing Alien and the Superhero. I bring you another video here on the Modern Ninja channel. Today is gonna be a weapon logs based on this straight sword that I've seen everywhere on social media. So let's get into it. Now, before we get into the meat of the video, I want to let you guys know that we're doing two giveaways on this channel for my 25,000 subscriber mark, but I'll go into details at the end of that video if you want to know more about that. All right, so this sword is, I've seen it so many places online, so, so many different places, whether it's Instagram, Twitter, uh, ads on Facebook, everywhere. I've seen this everywhere, and so I figured, you know, I'll grab it, check it out, see what I think about it, and show you guys what it comes with. So, first off, I want to talk about the case. The the sheath case thing, um, we'll go with the positives, and then we'll go with the negatives. Positives. Comes with a nice cushiony base so that you're not going to stab through it, so if you, like, you know, accidentally drop it on your hand or your kids are playing with it or something happens to it, it's not going to stab you. There's a nice cushiony base to it that it's not going to just slide through. Uh, and that's about where the positive stop with the case because this strap, as cool as it may look to be around your back, doesn't actually fit around a normal sized person's chest. Like it doesn't work across it just doesn't work that way and so what I found is it does fit through your belt loop so if you want to use this as more of a belt or just take the strap off and put on your own then that will work for you guys but this as is won't actually fit around your torso now let's get into the blades now it comes with obviously your main blade like this and it also comes with two of these throwing knives. Now throwing knives are pretty standard. They're very, very light, so you're gonna be um, wanting to look out for any windy days because any side wind can, might be able to throw this off very, very well because they are not heavy knives. However, they do come sharp, they'll sharp enough to throw in some wood and some you know target you have laying around your house. All in all, it's a nice little addition. It's two of them. They come strapped into the case here just like that, and they just whoop, fit in just like that with it strapped in together so it doesn't fall out but going into the actual blade so as far as the handle goes it's going to be a simple cloth wrap with what feels like two wooden planks to make it a little bit thicker so it fits in your hand just a little bit better it holds fairly nicely it's not the best grip in the world but it's certainly not the worst and if you really wanted to change it there's nothing stopping you from going out and grabbing some tennis grip or whatever grip you prefer and using that instead as far as the blade goes, it's very nice for simple things. Now, if you find yourself cutting through, you know, vines and weeds and vegetation like that, that it'll cut through pretty simple. But it is stainless steel, and that may be a problem for those of you that want to do heavier cuts, maybe wood or um, self-defense purposes, which, don't get me wrong, this will hurt people. <laughs> this will 100% hurt people, but... It might snap after a couple strikes against a bone or against wood or something like that. So keep that in mind when when looking for a sword. This is nice. This is cheap. But it's not going to be anything like Damascus steel or anything like that. It's going to be stainless steel. And just keep that in mind when you're buying um, this or any other weapon for whatever purpose you want to. Just to let you guys know, this is also not a tricking sword. This is sharp. Although it's not super sharp right now, obviously I can touch it and grab it, kind of. Uh, but if I squeeze, I'll cut myself. This is a blade. Obviously they can't ship it super sharp uh, for probably legal reasons or whatever other reasons they want to. But it is designed to be a blade and it is um, designed to be sharpened as such. And so this is not for, you know, doing tricks and doing crazy things with unless you're insane I think I did I've done tricks with this before and I'm probably insane but that's not what this is built for so keep that in mind for you guys want to do XMA this is not an XMA sword so that is going to be it for this episode I hope you enjoy the sword if you want links to this uh, sword they're gonna be as always down in the description for you guys uh, for your convenience, there's several colors. You don't have to get the black and silver. You can get uh, a variety of other colors that you really want. Whatever fits with the aesthetic you're going for. And the throwing knives will also match the blade that you uh, choose. 
Now, before I let you guys go, I want to let you know about the two giveaways I'm doing for my 25,000 subscriber mark. One of which is going to be on YouTube and one of which is going to be on Instagram. So if you're not following my Instagram, definitely check the links down in the description uh, for information on that. But for the YouTube one, since you guys are here already, all you have to do is leave a relevant comment on my video and leave a like on the video. And that enters you into the giveaway. Now, you can do however many comments you want. Uh, as long as they're relevant and not just random spam and you can do this on every video from now to when I hit 25,000 subscribers, but until next time don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know what you want to see next and what you want me to cover next here on this channel with all that said my name is DJ Moore this is the modern ninja and I'm out